Hello everyone, this is Bakari, and um, I am a avid fan of, you know, Keyboard Maestro, and I thought I would do this quick little video about um, a macro that I discovered recently, it's, it's been there forever, but I'm just not discovering it, and it's called the uh, Record Quick Macro, and if it's not already installed, it should be installed in your uh, Keyboard Maestro editor or library, but if it's not there, you can just go up to Windows, do Macro Library, and it's under interface controls, um, record quick macro, and just insert it there. So if it's not there, you can do that. So um, basically what this does is it's kind of a special macro that which you can record some steps on your Mac, and it will record those, and then you can instantly play back those steps. So we, in the, in the um, macro or the action, if you will, uh, it's already assigned some hotkeys, one, to, to get it started here. I changed mine to this one and then there's a you sign another hotkey to play back what you recorded so i use the kind of the asterisk key to play it back so the best way to kind of understand it is to show it in action so what i'm going to do is i'll show you here first off so basically like i have a um, evernote um note here that i want to debold all these timestamps right and normally in order to do that i would need to select you know, uh, select the, the stamp and do do command B to debold it and then deselect it here. So, I mean, you have to go through all those different steps, right? Well, if I record that step, I can repeat it using one keystroke and it won't be so monotonous. So let me show you here. So first of all, I'm going to pull up the record button using the high key. Okay. So here's the record button and basically it's going to record the keystrokes that I make and it's, it instantly starts recording. So I'm going to so, um, do a shift command left arrow to select and then I'm going to do the command B to debold it and then I'm going to do the right key to deselect it so it's recorded all those steps I'm going to click this button to stop it right there and now when I go to this one I'm going to use the um, asterisk key to play back what I just recorded and you see how it's just doing it really quickly so it saves me a few steps there, right there. So it's really simple. And basically what it does, it doesn't create a separate macro. It just it records a, a temporary macro that you can play back using your hotkey. And then once you use it again, it will, it will um, record over the last, you know, quick macro that you did and you do. Um, now, basically... For doing recordings like things like this, for using the recording, this is good for very precise movements or very precise uh, keystrokes on your Mac. So if like moving a window or minimizing a window or typing a series of keystrokes like we just did um, or activating uh, application or quitting the application, it's something is very specific. And before you start recording, you need to know kind of exactly what you're going to do before you start the recording process. And then you can immediately play it back um, using the um, your assigned hotkey. So I hope that doesn't sound too confusing. Kind of play around with it. See how it works for you. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment box. Thanks for listening.